Hey everybody on YouTube. Okay, uh, my daughter came to me. She wanted a step stool for my grandson. So uh, she said she's seen this thing out on the internet, and she de she described it to me. She explained it to me. So this is my version. Not sure how close it's going to come, but here it is. What I did was I bought two two by fours. I bought some shelving, the white laminate shelving. Okay. Uh, there's more of it and basically it was four pieces of three feet by 12 inch three feet high by 12 inches wide and it's three quarter inch um, shelving so I bought four sides at three feet high I bought two two by fours now what I did with the two by fours if you see how I screwed them in there and which is, is really nice because this the two inch uh, drywall course uh, screws don't show on the on the on the face so it's really like a perfect uh, perfect fit comes through and look it, it, it goes in just far enough where it doesn't penetrate the other side so it's a clean look and the way I got my spacing was I did a two by four put a two by four in the middle another two by four and so on which is it's not rocket science but basically that that that's my spacing so now that's going to be a shelf and when my grandson as he gets taller what we'll do is just lower the shelf so this is going to be basically over here once, once I screw everything together, you'll see this is be, this will be basically here with a front on it. Um, I'll, I'll add to the video, and then you could basically move this shelf, the shelf that's going to be in there, lower as he gets taller. So he could, uh, you know, you could you could put this step stool for him. He'll be totally enclosed. You can move this step stool wherever it is you want. I still got to build a base to it. Uh, but I'm showing you how to make it. So, as you can see, all my all my lines, and I pre-drilled the holes, and I did all my spacing. Uh, very simple tools, you know, square drill, uh, my uh, saw. Okay, you know. this is how I'm doing the inside spacing. If you notice, I'm using two by four. The blocks itself. What I did was I cut the back spacing shorter, so that I'm going to leave a little bit of a gap here. And when I put the other side on, it'll give me a little bit of a gap there if you see my spacing. Okay? And then what I'm going to do now is I'll pre-drill my holes, and then I'll throw my screws in it. And then when I go to put the other side panel on, everything will, it is already pre-drilled and spaced. So it's, it'll fit perfectly. And that, that's all. It just takes some time. Uh, but it's, it's no big deal. Do it right. Do it, you know, do it once. Measure twice. Cut once. And uh, just all take right. your time. Alright. Next step is done. Now the back is all screwed on. 2 by 4s are in place. Perfectly spaced. And now I'll do the other side. Okay. Here it is with its three sides on. And all the 2 by 4s are securely screwed inside. The nice part is, like I say, none of the screws show on the outside. Okay, here's the face of it. And this is just a shot looking inside it. But that's what it's going to look like. Okay, I did a simple layout to put the base on and just screwed it together. Okay, here is the majority of the step stool for my grandson that's built. And as you can see, shelf just slides out as it gets taller, slides down to the next one, and so on. There you go. I hope he enjoys it. Well, here's the finished product. As you can see, I filled in the holes with a plastic filler. Then I went over it with a spackle, and I definitely touched up with paint and sanding and paint and sanding also if you notice I cut these 
slots in so it could be easily moved around and I drilled holes in so these shelves could be pushed in and out there's your inside and if you look around the whole thing I filled in the back holes the same way with the plastic filler you know the wood putty and then the spackle and sanding and painting and <laughs> did that quite a few times but I think it came out pretty good what do you think that's it hope he enjoys it hope you enjoy it it's fun to build